An element can be represented using its chemical symbol, its mass number, and its atomic number. The atomic number tells us how many protons there are in an atom of this element. The mass number tells us how many neutrons and protons there are in an atom of this element. For example, lithium has the symbol Li. It has three protons and four neutrons in the nucleus. Three represents the number of protons. Seven represents the number of protons plus the number of neutrons. Each proton has a relative charge of plus one. So the total charge of the nucleus is plus three. To balance the charge of the protons, we must have the same number of electrons as the number of protons. Three electrons will give us a total charge of minus three. This atom, therefore, now has an overall charge of zero. It is neutral. Here's another example. The symbol for sodium is Na, and we're given the mass number and the atomic number. The atomic number tells us that a sodium atom has 11 protons. It also has 11 electrons to balance the charge. To find out the number of neutrons that it has, we need to subtract 11 from 23. This means that a sodium atom has 12 neutrons.